All right, we're here to show how to adjust the H206 sprinkler from Orbit. Um, this has multiple patterns and it has various different adjustments for um, spray diameter as well as spray distance. And um, it's very, very easy to adjust once you get the hang of it. So um, the first thing you need to select is the pattern that you want. The H206 has the patterns listed here around the top. You just turn this green ring there to the one that you want. This white arrow indicates the pattern that's in use. So um, you have a large, medium, and small stream. You also have, um, this is a flat sort of horizontal fan. This is a vertical fan. And then you have a shower, which is a sort of seven small streams of water. It's a very light, so if you have delicate plants, you may want to use that. And then here on the top, we have the sort of range adjustment ring. And you'll notice, if you uh, check out here, there's three small tabs. One is long, there's a medium and a short one, and then there's also a section that you can select that doesn't have any tabs. These will diffuse the water. So if you, for example, were using this large one, there's a large stream of water that's coming out here. Now in this case, where I have nothing selected, that's when it will go the furthest. If I select the tallest ring, that, the water's going to hit this as it comes out and break up and that's going to cause it to um, go a much shorter distance than if I had nothing selected at all. And then these two tabs in the middle sort of give you an intermediate range between the, the two extremes. So you would select sort of the range that you want, and you might need to play with it a little bit to finally decide what range works best for the um, area of the yard that you're deploying this to. And then finally is how to select the diameter, and that's where these um, two green rings here at the base come into play. The sprinkler is going to oscillate back and forth between the two tabs. So right now I've got them set to about 90 degrees, so it's going to do about a 90 degree arc. If I wanted to do 180 degrees, I would probably move one of these to the other side, and that would give me um, you know, a full 180 degrees. Now if I needed 360 degrees, I would actually align both tabs right above each other. And it's going to go around, it'll hit this one, it'll stop it and cause it to reverse direction, come all the way back and then keep doing that. So you can adjust this really to any distance that you want. You can do a, a much shorter one or a much larger one. Anyway, that's how you adjust the H206 sprinkler. If you have any more, more questions, please let us know and we're happy to help. Thanks. Bye.